We're counting down Pro Football Weekly's top 32 draft prospects. Right now, we're down to number 21. We give you one every single day. Today, it's Michael Brockers, the third-year sophomore from LSU. We know a lot of talent from that Tigers defense. He really jumped out this year. What stands out about him on film? Well, his length really stands out. His strength overall, I think he's going to be a very solid point of attack player. He could fit in a 3-4 defense or a 4-3, so he's got versatility as well. What are teams concerned about when they watch and evaluate Michael Brockers? I think he's very young at the stage of his development, uh, one of the youngest players in the draft. He's still learning the game uh, instinctually, and I think it's going to take him some time to learn what it means to be a true pro. We've seen in recent years a couple of defensive linemen, a few taken very early from LSU, guys like uh, Glenn Dorsey and Tyson Jackson with somewhat, a little bit success, but not really the success you expect from a really high draft pick. Can Brockers break that mold? I mean, how do you see him fitting into the first round? Uh, both Jackson and Dorsey are playing as 3-4 uh, defensive ends right now. I think there's a chance we'll see the same with Brockers and it may be a better fit. Even though he played as a 4-3 interior player, there's a good chance he'll project as an outside player in a 3-4 defense. How high do you see him going? I think there's a good chance he'll fit into the top 15 based on his upside and what he could become. It's just so difficult to find players of his size and stature and his length. And I think he's going to fill an immediate need. Another one of those guys you're drafting you hope they become something. Not sure if he's quite there just yet. You can check out our full top 32 by logging onto our YouTube page. You can subscribe to us there at youtube.com slash profootballweekly.